Welcome back or welcome to my channel. So today I'm back with another hair review. Today's video is sponsored by this company here. I'm not sure how to pronounce this. So I'm not even gonna butcher their name like that, but they are the sponsor of today's video. They were kind enough to send me over this 613 unit that I ended up doing some color on, dyeing it a little bit. And yeah, I'm not gonna do too much talking. We're just gonna jump right into the video. I'm gonna start with the unboxing. So this is what their packaging looks like. It comes in this black drawstring bag and it's got their logo on it. And yeah, yellow inside the bag is your wig this is a 24 inch body wave unit and i believe this is a 13 by 4 lace frontal but yeah it comes inside of a clear ziploc bag and then they also just sent two new wig caps and that's the only thing they sent in the bag so this is what the hair looks like straight out the bag this is the construction on the unit it has three combs in the front a comb in the back lace in the back and an adjustable strap like i said this is a 13 by 4 lace frontal and also like i mentioned it is a body wave unit and yeah this is what the hairline looks like straight out of the bag I didn't do any customizing to the hairline, but um, yeah, this is what it looks like and that's just how I left it And yeah, that is it for the unboxing. I'm loving this color. I got this color off of TikTok I'm gonna insert the video of like how I dyed it because I didn't film me dyeing it I got this video off of TikTok, so I'm just gonna insert her video and give her her credit. Shout out to her This is her page and then this is the TikTok that I went by the video that she did So yeah, she used the color mocha by adora. So that's the color that I used as well I did the same exact process that she did in the TikTok. So I'll just leave that here and I also put the link to her TikTok in the description box. So if you want to go to it, if you want to try it yourself, then it'll be down there. Has my lighting been weird this whole time? I don't know. But anyway, yeah. So that's how I dyed this unit. I didn't film me dyeing it or explain it or anything like that. Just refer to this TikTok if you want to know how to do it. And yeah, now we're going to jump into the install portion and then I'll give y'all my review and thoughts on this wig afterwards. So yeah, on to the install portion.
All right, y'all, so that was the install portion. Now I'm gonna give y'all my thoughts on this unit because I really like it. I love how the color came out, like this simple type of look. Like I didn't do no, you know, bright, vibrant color, nothing like that, just kept it neutral. And I really like how it came out. So shout out to the girl from TikTok because this is cute. I've never seen anybody do this um before till I saw her video, I've never seen anybody do it like this, like use this color how she did. So yeah, I really like it. And she be doing bomb on all her units. She does units, I think you can like ship her your units or I don't know if she sells hair or not, but yeah, she'll dye your units for you and send it back to you or whatever. So yeah, she fine with it. But yeah, okay. They didn't send me the density, but I'll ask them and be sure to put it in the description box. So just look there for that. But as far as the density goes, um, it's a pretty decent density. I wish it was a little bit thicker. It's just a little bit thinner than I would prefer my units, but um, it's not bad at all. So yeah, that's how I feel about the density of the unit. I like the length. It is giving 24 inches. Obviously it's curled right now. So it's like this but if i pull it i'm gonna pull it too much and mess up my curls this is where it stops at on me and i'm 5'3 by the way so yeah that's where it stops on me it is giving 24 inches it is really soft it does shed a little bit that was another issue i had but that's expected with blonde units anyway but nothing too crazy but yeah it does shed a little bit it is big head friendly y'all and the hairline on the sides were low enough they weren't pushed far back i didn't have to snatch at it to get it past my hairline none of that so it's big head friendly the hairline is low enough that always gives you extra points in my book because i'll be struggling with these companies that be having their wigs too small or their hairlines be way back here yeah no issue there i feel like the lace is pretty good i installed it with got to be sprayed i had a little i don't know what happened right here i don't know if this is makeup or lace tint the color of my lace tint but i sprayed lace tint all over it's just this area right here so i'm not really sure what happened right here but um it doesn't look too bad but the lace is pretty good didn't really have an issue there any issue i had is probably just me because i'm not sure what happened right there but it's like super brown compared to the rest of the lace and i use the same product throughout i'd use the um boho lace tint and caramel that's what i use and then i put my makeup on it i use the tart i mix the tart shape tape concealer in tan sand and then i also mix in my fenty foundation in 420 and i'm gonna do like a couple drops of that to like try and make it match but yeah i did that all over but for whatever reason it's like i don't know what happened right there but that ain't got nothing to do with them that's just something i did so the lace no issue there. Y'all know body wave units tend to hold a curl better than straight units. So I feel like it'll hold a curl pretty well. And I also like how it turned out when I did the flexi rod. I wand curled it and then flexi rod it. It's not the same method I did in my Shein video or my graduation pictures video where I put a little bit of mousse on it, wand curled it, and then wrapped it around the flexi rod. I just wand curled it and wrapped it around the flexi rod and sprayed it with hairspray and let it sit till it cooled or whatever. Well, basically while I was doing my makeup, it would have been cool by the time I finished my makeup. So yeah. So based off of all of that, I'm gonna give this unit an eight out of 10 for the density and the shedding even though shedding is expected with blonde hair yeah i'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10 so yeah that's my thoughts on this unit i really like her i really like how the color came out again shout out to that girl that posted the video and did this color first well, i'm not sure she was the first one to ever do it but that's where i saw it so i'm gonna say she did it first and i ain't seen nobody else do it either so yeah shout out to her and thank you again to this company for sponsoring this video like i said i don't know how to pronounce their name i'm not gonna butcher their name like that y'all i'm not gonna do them like that but thank you for sponsoring this video if you want the link to this unit it will be in the description box below if you want to purchase it yourself if i have a coupon code i will also put that in the description box but yeah that is it for this video make sure you check out my website whoshebeauty.com where i sell my lashes my big blinks which are my 25 millimeter lashes and my baby blinks which are my shorter lashes for my natural girls i'm wearing a pair of my big blinks right now this is in the style prada this is from my fluffy series which are big blinks only fluffier so yeah i'm wearing the style prada right now so go shop my lashes i also sell lip gloss my tinted glosses that i make myself my lip candies those are my tinted glosses I have Juicy Watermelon, which is a red tint, Georgia Peach, which is a peachy tint, and Cocoa Kisses, which is what I'm wearing right now, which is a brown tint. Super moisturizing lip glosses. I have people asking for them all the time. Every time I restock, I sell out of them. So what does that tell you? So go shop my tinted glosses. If you're not a fan of the tinted glosses, I also have regular clear gloss, which is also moisturizing as well. I have Strawberry Kiwi, which is a regular clear gloss. And then I have Diced Pineapples, which is a clear glitter gloss. I also sell bags. I have the Crystal Money bags. I have Spring Mini bags. I have Rhinestone Face Mask. COVID is not gone, especially after the holidays. Holidays. people been gathering and stuff numbers that went up get you a face mask you can be cute with it and get you a rhinestone one. so yeah go shop my face mask i also sell press lines that i make myself you can shop any of the designs that i have on my website or you can do my business page on instagram who's she beauty we can discuss a custom order over there i do accept custom orders i also sell jewelry necklaces anklets i sell sweat sets i sell handmade velvet do rags and i also sell lash tweezers if you have trouble applying your lashes lash tweezers are what you need so once you get your lashes from me make sure you get your pair of lash tweezers on your way out but yeah i think that's everything on my website so yeah go check out my website whoshebeauty.com link in the description as well as a link to my business page on instagram well that's it for this video y'all i hope you all enjoyed don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel please 
and thank you. And make sure your post notifications are on so you don't ever miss when I post because you don't want to do that. You don't wanna do that. I know I told y'all I'm done with hair videos for the month of January, but I got super behind last week on video. So I have two videos coming out. This will be the last one to come out, I think. It might be one more after this. And then I'm done with hair videos for the month of January. Um, Cause I wanna wear my hair like I told y'all. So y'all be getting a little bit more different content from me and also some content with my real hair. So yeah, if you see some videos, I know I said last month I wasn't doing any in January. I just got behind last week. Just had some things going on. My grandfather passed away. We had his funeral Christmas Eve. I just got behind that whole week so yeah I'm finally getting caught up and getting these videos out so they weren't out before the year was over so they'll be out the first week of January sometime so yeah make sure your post notifications are on and I'll see y'all in my next video bye